Hello everybody and welcome back to Brimple Plays Blackthorn Arena. This is chapter 5, episode 13. We have a couple of people healing right now, and we probably want to get Akbar in there as well. We're trying to catch up in terms of our favor right now so that we can host the Grand Games. We're not able to do that right now with our current level of favor. We need to gain about 800 more to overcome our enemies. With our current health, we might be able to challenge somebody. Not sure. Level 17? I think we could take these guys. Let's just make sure with our health again. Yeah. Let's try and challenge them. Get that favor. 94. We need to do what we can to catch up in favor. Challenging people like this is a good opportunity for us to earn money as well, and good experience. I'm not going to bet for the 10 silver. It just seems... It seems like if I bet, that would make things go wrong. I'm that superstitious at this point. Team looks tough, you know. Okay, let's see it's one. Yes! The breakthrough. That was sick. That is what he is designed for. He is designed to combo those moves. Every battle monk I make should be comboing energy shield and breakthrough. Easy win, big favor, a little bit of money. Nobody's hurt too bad either, I can actually send them out again. If I wanted to, I guess. Hmm, yeah, level 17's again. We can continue to fight these low levels, gain a hundred influence per fight, and that's, I mean, it's not a hundred, it's a little bit less. But we're catching up to our enemies pretty quickly, I think. And we can gain a lot of influence by fighting creatures, typically. Again, if we got a hundred and five from fighting a chameleon, we can find something worthwhile. You know, whether it's a lion or something else. The fat ogre being worth 75, I think that was kind of an anomaly. That was in a prior episode. I don't know that you... Oh. It, it's Akbar that I wanted to see do big damage. With that flail. 43, okay. You have block break for 1.7. I mean, that's that's all right, I guess. I would like to see you block break even more. Because you have additional block break on your weapon, and because you have so much penetration with that weapon, in terms of sharp and blunt penetration. Everybody's getting close to leveling up again. Practice fights. It won't take up the day or hurt the training gladiators. That's true, but it will affect their morale. It can, anyways. And be aware that they may just run away at the end of a practice fight if you make their morale too low. Sounds crazy. It's true. Look at that escaped slave situation. We're already up to about 2700 with 20 days to go and the the highest influence right now is desolate fort at 3200 so i'm not you know incredibly worried about our influence at this point going in man 
I'm really considering this. No, I don't I don't have the health right right now to do it, I guess. Yeah, you're pretty messed up. We can craft a lot of large healing potions though. Perhaps we should do that. Heal our people and then go capture a champion slave. That's what we're trying to do. We want to go out there and capture a champion. Do we though? We don't want to do that, do we? I think we want to continue to challenge people. That's what the voice in the back of my head is saying. It says we need to continue to challenge people until we are confident that we will come out on top. Swan, you get a free level out of this just because we like what you do. It's time for you to become a Ronin, probably. I, I, don't, I don't know what you were building towards. You need to become a Berserker, I guess. That didn't get you next level? Goodness. You could do a lot of things. I don't know. Let's get going. Well, we did say we were going to go on one of these. So we should go on one. We said we would, so we should. So let's go. Oh no, somebody else got the legendary armor set from Alianus. That is actually, uh, you know, rough, or it can be. That does make a difference. The guys with Gordas's gear can be a, a real pain in the butt. You know, they, they hit hard. They hit really, really hard. So you hope that you don't face up against them and have them attack your team. Anyways, it makes a difference. I can't write them off. Who's this? Whitley. Whitley. Obviously, you're the champion here. You appear to be a battle monk. The way you... No, you power strike. You're a gladiator. I don't know. I think I'm just going to sell some of you people. Frankly. You guys kind of suck. And by kind of, I mean you all appear to really suck. I don't see that you have any champions with you. Let's cancel our withdrawal just to check. Make sure there's no chest hidden anywhere here. Obviously there's cages. Hmm. There's a pumpkin there. No chest, though. It appears that way, anyways. Yeah, I don't see one. We will withdraw. And you are worth more based on your level, so we will take the 15 and the 14. We will go get rid of you. Can we get rid of those two by sending a servant to the market? We ought to find out. It's too bad we didn't see a champion available there. What, Pete, what are you going to do? You're just going to pout over there? Is that your plan? It's fine if it is. I don't care. I'm going to sell you. Okay, first of all, do you have any epic stuff here? You do have epic stuff. Wow. I want all of your epic stuff. We're selling our, our old archer stuff because, you know, that's not coming back in style, frankly. And we don't need that. We don't need that. Obviously, we don't need that. 
So again, champion medium leg armor, champion medium boots. That's really cool. I love that. Material, haberdasher, blah, blah, blah. Browse slaves. Can I sell my people? No. I need to actually go there to sell my people, don't I? Uh. I really just don't want them, like, demoralizing the rest of my team. You know, stinking up the living quarters. However they're going to stink it up, I don't know. They just, they, they just don't fit in with the rest of my team, so I, I don't want them here. They're kind of like people we thought were leaving immediately, but they've somehow stuck around. We don't know how to get rid of them. Let's get going. We gotta fight. We gotta continue to fight. We can't worry about the stinky people who are crashing on our couch for like a month, two months. They said they were looking for an apartment. They're not. Oh my god. Three crossbow users and one of them is wearing light veteran tier 2. That's horrifying. You gotta understand, that is just a nightmare. Everyone on this team has the ability to come back from the dead, I'm pretty sure. But that doesn't, you know, make me feel any better. Not when the crossbow guy just wants to continuously knock you down and kill you. I guess they didn't get that opportunity, being that they're all pretty much dead. I, I knocked them down and beat them down. It was scary, though. It's so scary fighting people with crossbows. You can't blame me. You've seen them kill my team. Robert is continuing to do a surprising amount of damage with an S-Talk. I am not understanding what's happening with him. I don't understand why his dan- Oh, well, t the tenacity and volition maybe with headbutt. I don't know. <laughs> There's- <laughs> Who was that? Who, who was that standing out there? Who, who are you? Hill? We gotta get rid of you, man. You look, you look like you're lost standing out here. You looked ridiculous, I'm sorry. You made me laugh. Yeah, you need to continue to research. What, what can, can you, yeah. I can't talk. We will go to the second marketplace really quick. Make sure everybody that needs to heal is healing. Second marketplace. We need to sell our two losers. If I don't get 90 silver a piece for them, I'm going to raise a complaint with the market. I'm not, I'm not here to sell gear. I'm here to sell people. Hill, you need to leave. 80 silver a piece. Disgusting. Pete, get out of here. 75 silver. Hmm. We'll take what we can get. We can't really complain, I guess. Veteran medium gauntlets. We've been waiting for those for so long. We've been looking for them everywhere. Thank you. And since we're already out, we may as well go to the next market real quick. I don't see... Oh, hey, veteran heavy chest armor. We've been looking for that forever, I know that. I was about to say I don't see what we need, but I did see what we needed. I wish we got more champion medium gear. Although, we should have already been in a position to craft that by now. We've just uh, failed to keep up. Erwin, you don't need the champion heavy gear. It is... Well, first of all... Akbar? You're... No, 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 no. 
It's Robert I wanted to give the veteran medium gauntlets to. Welcome to five pieces of a set. The stamina reduction is nice enough for you. Again, I just can't believe you're doing all that damage with such a terrible weapon. Maybe I'm wrong and that's a good weapon. And I just don't really understand the game as well as I'd like to believe. You have a machete, Swan, which just seems dumb. Just like you. Dumb. But you have heavy veteran armor now. Chest armor, so whatever. You're doing pretty well. High tenacity. You do great with a headbutt. You do big things with headbutt. I don't think you have it, though. Doesn't matter. We need to look for more fights. All we all we can think about is fighting. We have a bloodlust. 50 favor? I don't... 90 for a crocodile? Makes no sense, right? 105 to kill a bunch of newbies, but it's already started. 150 for a bas basilisk? Oh my goodness. I can't even do the crocodile. It's brutal. I don't want to fight people in, you know, that are my level in champion gear. I'm I'm going to wait a turn here. I'm not saying we're running out of time by any means. 260 favor to kill a wear snake with one person? Okay. Uh, Erwin. I choose you. Go, k go kill a wear snake, dude. For 260 favor? Like, how do they come up with the number on that? That's crazy. Didn't it say that was a level 11 fight? Now imagine if he had full champion gear. He would be very scary to everybody. He's only very scary to most people right now. 53 plus 96. Yeah, you're tough. But to Kiara, you're just another loser. You need to get some better gear, Erwin. That's all I'm saying. Maybe try knocking this guy down with your dash ability. I think if he just knocked him down with the dash, it would have been over quicker. But 260 favor, you can't go wrong, right? That's, I mean, that's just crazy. I like that that happens, though. You know, it, it just catapults you forward over everybody else. I mean, it can. It, it didn't for me. I'm still behind, but I'm close, you know, so just keep that in mind. I'm close. Let's heal you, Erwin. Erwin, always getting hurt. Hurtwin. Ugh. Let's go check out what we can do to overcome Desolate Fort and Carol's Prison. I'm not fighting totally young for 115 favors. We could, actually. We probably could go beat up Tully Young for 115 favor. That is very ex uh, dangerous. I was about to say expensive. Like, what? Level 16s for 73 favor. I'm willing to take it. Or 17s for 113 favor. That's what we want to take. And then we'll look for, again, like a animal fight or something stupid. We're just trying to make sure that we get enough favor to be told that um, we're already ahead of everybody going in. Abu will talk to you the day before and say, like, either, hey, you need to perform really well because you have less favor than your enemies, or you just need to survive this because you have more favor than your enemies. And I think, you know, if, if we're being real, I think it works out for you either way. But I just don't want to take any risks. What if I'm wrong? You know, I, I, don't, I don't know everything. 
Swan, I liked that attack. I didn't like to see Erwin get knocked down. I do like to see Robert taking it to this stupid Firewatch champion lady. She deserves that, man. She came in champion gear with a crossbow. Again, that's always an indicator that they want to kill you. Look, and he just dashes forward, smacks her. The Chevalier is dangerous, I don't care what you say. Ooh, god, she just knocked down three people. Can someone, like, kick her? Can someone crit her? Look at that, she is surviving everything. I told you Chevaliers are very powerful. Robert, you have five health. You don't need to be trying to take her down. I know you'll get back up, but... <laughs> I think you got uh, revived by Akbar, actually. I'm pretty sure I saw that happen. It looked like you went down and Akbar just said, Mwah, get back up. I don't think you got up instantly. You could have. Still, impressive. Just a little bit of money. Nothing huge. Took surprisingly little damage from that fight. Uh, like, sustained damage, considering how badly we actually got messed up, it seemed. I was going to do more of these story missions, and maybe I still will. You know, I, I, uh, it's just hard. It's hard to imagine who, who I have... Besides Erwin, I, I need to gear my people up, man. They just suck. My people suck. Level 15's in this. Ah, uh, there it is. Stellarm. I, I, knew, I knew you had a trick up your sleeve. I'm not stupid. 119 favor for an easy tournament. 180 for this. To fight Herencia, Jack Gouger... She is really tough, but... Man, I'm, I'm just wondering. Is that worth the risk? We have 13 days, and we need, like, 100. Let's, I don't know that we need to do that. Let's just fight easy things. Keep our team alive until the Grand Games, unless, you know, it seems like it's absolutely necessary. That would have been cool, a samurai bow with um, my archer, if if one ever lived to be long enough, you know, or lived long enough to see that. That would have been really, really neat. I guess I did have a legendary bow in uh, one of my last playthroughs. Although I think the archer using the legendary bow died, didn't they? Oh god, this is a tanky team. I saw a mountain peak and a juggernaut, which is, you know, two tanky people. Then you look at their gear, one of them is wearing champion heavy, one of them is wearing some kind of veteran tier 2, I didn't see what quality. Oh no, champion. We got two people wearing champion. The juggernaut. Oh gosh, she hit hard. Or someone hit hard. But I'm tough to take down too, and I hit hard. God, you guys. <laughs> With the knockdowns, everyone's just getting thrown around the arena right now. We gotta try and keep Robert alive. He's obviously the target of the Yvonnel Mountain Peak. He went down. He's back up. Ooh, she tried to dash forward and do something mean. I want to transform all of his stuff to Veteran Tier 2. That was a tough fight, man. I, I knew when I saw a Juggernaut in a Mountain Peak 
that they were going to be tough. Obviously, I didn't read their name before we went into that. Why would I? They were like level 16. Heavy veteran leg armor tier 2. Okay, we like that. But you won't have time to craft everyone's armor. Well, maybe you will. Do I now go back to the market? Seems like that would be... Or j I'll, I could just send a servant, I guess. What's 30 silver at this point, right? Doesn't look like there's going to be anything new. The veteran heavy chest armor may be worth taking if I do transform uh, the other guy. Because he's got champion chest armor on right now. Oh, look at this. Champion cloaks. We must sell all the garbage in our inventory right now, immediately. Anti-magic scales, get rid of them. Okay. We want a monster butcher cloak, probably. We know we want two champions cloaks. Probably a monster butcher cloak. I would think so. And we're already down to just one gold. So we'll check out of there. Who can we give the better armor to? It's tempting to give you something different. Something like monster butcher pants plus cloak. Because that would count as two parts for the set. You're doing fine with the assassin's gear though. We will give you a champion's cloak. Then. That's. I guess that's not two parts of the set. I thought cloak was. Maybe just. For monster butcher it is. Champion's cloak is not part of the set. Okay. Robert. You are going to take. A monster butcher cloak I believe. It just seems right. I don't know. And Swan, you will take a champion's cloak. Okay. We really need to research more armor. Build more armor. Can you build anything right now? Veteran medium tier 2 gauntlets. You may as well begin crafting that right now because we might end up asking you to craft that anyways. And you're not doing anything else. 112 favor to kill some or ooh, three orcs though. They're not just some nobodies, they're orcs. Eleven days till the Grand Venations, and we are certainly on track to be the host. A level 15 Bruteman? Anyone on our team should be able to kill the level 15, except for Liz. Liz, just don't even think about doing anything. We will send Erwin just to get some easy favor. Because every team, every turn we are not getting favor. It's possible that the enemy is. We can't let them pull too far ahead of us. Or we risk not hosting the Grand Games. And we need to host and to win the Grand Games in order to call ourselves victorious. That's what this whole game is about. You restore glory by hosting and by winning the Grand Games. And clearing your family name, which your father sullied by cheating through the use of magic in a prior fight when he, your family owned the Blackthorn Arena prior. You've only recently purchased it in a bid to uh, restore glory. Yeah, of course you beat the level 15 archer. I should... eh. I was about to say I should have killed her, but I gained so much favor from letting her live that I got over 100 favor in total from that fight. And it cost me nothing but a second.
cool. We will have you research something. And that is where we will end this episode. When we come back, we'll be fighting in the Grand Venations for sure. Only 10 days, so not far at all. I will catch you next time. Thank you, and bye.